Hello everybody. In the pre previous example, we have studied about the rules for calculating the um, first set, and we have seen two examples on how to calculate first set. In this tutorial, we will learn how to calculate the follow set. So let's begin. Here. Firstly, see what is follow set. That is, if we want to suppose say calculate the follow of any non-terminal, that is a. Which is equal to set of terminals that immediately follow A in any string occurring on the right side of productions of the grammar. It means that if we want to calculate follow of any non-terminal, then we will calculate. We have to calculate the set of terminals that immediately follow that non-terminals. For calculating follow set, we have three rules. So let's begin with the rule number first. Here we have. <coughs> rule 1 according to rule number 1 if suppose say we have to we have any string say if a which gives us um, say it provides us x y beta and we have to calculate follow of b Sorry, follow of y. Suppose say we have to calculate follow of y. Then according to the first rule, follow of y would be equal to first of beta. First of beta. If and only if beta does not gives epsilon. That is, beta does not produces epsilon. Okay, beta should not provide epsilon. That is, beta does not derive to any string which contains epsilon. This this was the rule number one. Now moving to rule number two. So now according to rule number two, if a derives to any string say x beta y, and we have to calculate follow of y. Follow of y. Then, according to rule number two, follow of y would be same as follow of a in this case. Okay. And now coming to rule number three. Let's take next page. Mm, we go here. Rule number three. To calculate the follow set for um, according to rule number three, if we have any non-terminal which provides us if a provides us <coughs> x, y, and beta, and in this case beta provides any string which contain epsilon, then here we will have Follow of y would be equal to first of beta, first of beta minus epsilon union follow of a. So this is the this is the third rule on calculation of follow set i would like to tell you that in the beginning follow of any starting symbol say follow of s follow of s is always equal to dollar it is a convention that any string that is a any term non terminal that is a starting non terminal that is say s will always give dollar as its a follow set Okay, thank you for watching this video. In the next video, we will cover the examples on how to calculate the follow set and first set.